Morning guys, Ilza here from Health and Active. We're doing another stretch class today. So we're going to do a slight warm-up. Everything is no impact, no jumping around. Doing our warm-up and then we start with our stretch class. So as soon as everybody's ready, make sure you've got enough space to move, enough space to stretch comfortably without touching a wall or a table or anything. Um, so we're starting with our warm-up as soon as you're ready. Right guys, so we're starting with our warm-up, just a nice static walk, just to get the blood flowing, get everything loose, try to raise the heart rate a bit, but just to get the blood pumping, pumping to all the muscles. Okay, so as soon as you've walked for about a minute or so, we're going to go into squats. From the squats, we're going to do front raises, side raises to loosen up the shoulders. But while you're walking, use those arms, get the shoulders loose. Okay, so from your static walk, we're going into squats. Feet shoulder width apart, toes facing forward. And from there, just partial squats, not all the way down. One, two. Three, work with the arms, four, five, six, seven, eight, nice and slow, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Very good. So let's do a few front raises, loosening up the arms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and to the side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And 10. Very good. Shake out the arms. Now we're going to do a combination. Front and side raises. One. And side. Two. Good. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Feel a slight burn in your shoulder already. Nine. 10, 11, and 12. Very good. Shake out the arms. Back to our legs. We're going to do a static lunge. So placing your left foot to the front, right foot to the back. Hands on your hips and just slight up and down movements. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Very good. Switch the legs around. Right leg to the front, left leg to the back. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Very good. Okay, roll out the shoulders. Nice big circles to the back. Remember to keep on breathing. Don't hold your breath at any time during the stretch class. And to the front. Nice big circles. All right, rolling out the wrists. Nice and slow, big circles with the hands. And change direction to the other side. Good. And rolling out the hips. Hands on your hips. Nice big circles with the hips. Keep the belly nice and tight. Loosening up the hips. Preparing them for the stretches that's coming up. Over to the other side. <clears throat> Very 
Very good. Once you're done with that, take a sip of water, relax a second. We're going to start with our upright stretches and then moving on to the mat. So get your mat ready, get a towel ready, and then we'll start with the stretches. Right guys, so we've completed our warm up. Let's start stretching from our head down to the toes and then we're moving on to the mat. Shoulders stay horizontal. Don't drop the shoulders to the side. Always keep them still and relaxed. Tilt the head over. Feel the stretch down the side of your neck into your shoulder. Remember to breathe. Take nice deep breaths. Very good. And up. Over to the other side. Like I said, don't drop the shoulders. Keep them still. Keep the belly nice and tight. Keep on breathing. And up. Your head to the front. Chin to your chest. Feel it stretching down the back of your neck. Good. And up. Your chin as high as you can, as far back as you can. Feel the stretch down your throat. Good. And slowly up. Right, right arm comes across the chest, left hand on your elbow and gently pull it towards your chest. Keep the shoulders nice and relaxed. Keep them horizontal. Good, push it back as far as you can. Feel the stretch in your chest. Keep it there. And move over to the other side, left arm across your chest, hand on the elbow. Always keep on breathing, don't hold your breath. Very good, and push it back. Chest out, shoulders relaxed, and relax, shake out the arms. Right, feet is shoulder width apart. We're reaching up to the ceiling as high as you can, making yourself tall. Up, 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 try to touch that ceiling. Very good. From there, dropping your left hand, leaning over to the left, bringing the right arm as far over as you can go. Keep on breathing. Good. Slowly back to the middle. Both hands up in the air. Dropping your right hand to the side and leaning over. Feel the stretch down the side of your body. Very good. Both hands up again and we lean backwards as far back as you can. Feel the stretch in the abdominals. From there, slowly come forward, straightening out the back, getting your body horizontal, pushing your hands as far forward as you can. Nice deep breaths. From there, lowering the hands and raising them up at the back. Keep on breathing. Very good and relax. All right, now we're placing our feet a little bit wider, toes still facing forward, hands down to the floor. Remember, only bending at the hips, keeping your back as straight as possible. Going down as low as you can. If you're not touching the floor, that's fine. Just go down until you feel the stretch in your hamstring. And slowly up. Very good. Bringing your feet together. Take a breather. We're moving down to our mats. Right guys, so we're down on our mats. Everybody have a seat. Legs, legs straight to the front. Remember, chest out, back nice and straight. And we're slowly reaching down to our toes. If you can't reach your toes, just go down as far as your body allows. Reaching down to the toes, 
Getting a good stretch in the back, in the legs. Nice deep breaths. And keep it there. Hold it. Don't release. Hold it there. Very good. And slowly up. From there, we're opening up the legs nice and wide. I want you to feel the stretch in the inner thigh already. Back is nice and straight and we're reaching forward. As far forward as you can go. Nice deep breaths. Keep on breathing. Very good. And slowly up. Next one, we're keeping our chest open to the front, placing your hand either on your foot or in line with your hip, bringing your left arm over and going down as low as you can. If you're placing your hand on your foot, get your head down to your knee. Otherwise, bending the right elbow, going down nice and low. Very good. Slowly up and over to the other side. Chest is open to the front. Right arm comes over. Left elbow bends, getting nice and low with your body. Feel the stretch down your ribcage, down the side of your back. Very good. And slowly up. From there, we're turning to the right. Both hands on your right foot. If you can't reach your foot, use your towel. Loop it around your foot and just get that extra bit of pull down to your knee. Getting your head as close to your knee as possible. Still taking nice deep breaths. Very good. Slowly up. Moving over to the other side. Turning your body to the left. Both hands on your left foot. Head nice and low. Remember to breathe. Don't hold your breath. Very good. And up. Okay, now we're keeping the right leg nice and wide. We're bringing in our left foot as close to the body as possible. Letting the knee drop to the side and we're leaning forward. Feel the stretch in your left glute, down the side of your leg. Leaning forward as far as you can go. Nice deep breaths. Keep on breathing. Good. And slowly up. Switching the legs around. Extending the left leg to the side again. Nice and wide. Bringing in the right leg as close to the body as possible. And we're leaning forward. Remember to breathe. You'll even, even feel the stretch down your back, down your lower back, leaning forward as far as your body allows. Very good. And relax, placing the feet nice and wide again. Hands on the floor, walking forward with your fingers as far as you can go. From there, we're opening up the arms, placing them on your feet, getting nice and low with your head and your upper body. Very good. Keep on breathing. And 
and slowly up. Remember to straighten out the back, push out the chest, placing your right hand behind your back, left hand on your right thigh, looking over your right shoulder, turning the shoulders. Good. Facing the front, left hand behind your back, right hand on your left thigh, looking over your left shoulder. And keep on breathing. Very good. Facing forward. Now we're bringing in both feet. Getting your feet touch in front of you. Knees dropping to the side and we're reaching forward. Remember your breathing. And slowly up. Okay, take a sip of water, let the muscles relax a bit and then we'll continue. Okay guys, so we've turned around, we're on our bellies, getting nice and relaxed. Remember, arms to the front, placing your head between your arms. And I want you to take five nice deep breaths, in through the nose, out through the mouth, relaxing all the muscles as you're doing it. Breathing nice and deep. Three more to go. Two more. Last one. Very good. Getting your body nice and relaxed. We're reaching back with our right hand, grabbing a hold of the right ankle, stretching out the quad. Remember to breathe while you're doing this. Don't hold your breath. Feel the stretch in your quad. If you can't reach your ankle, use your towel. Loop it around your foot just to get that extra bit of pull. Very good. And relax. Switching over to the left side. With your left hand, reach back. Grab hold of your left ankle. And relax. Your breathing. Just focus on the breathing. Feel the muscle that you're stretching. Very good. And back to the middle. Now I want you to bring your left arm across your chest. Straighten it out. Use your right hand as support and stretch out the shoulder. Getting that left arm nice and straight. Managing the pressure that your upper body is putting on the shoulder with your right hand. Feel the stretch in your shoulder blade. Very good. Switch it over to the other side. So you're using your left hand to manage the pressure. Right arm is straight and stretching out the shoulder. Very good. And relax. Back to the middle. As you're lying there, raise your feet, making nice big circles with your feet, rolling out the ankles. Very slowly. And change direction. Just getting the joints moving in another way than they normally do. Good, and relax. From there, you're pushing yourself up. 
with your hands in line with your shoulders you're keeping your hips on the floor raising your upper body and looking up to the ceiling feel the stretch in your abdominals taking nice deep breaths very good and back down we're going up for a second one remember pushing yourself up pressing your hips to the floor tilting your head back Good, and down. Last one, going up nice and high, tilting your head back. Nice deep breaths. Very good, and relax. Keeping your hands in line with your shoulders, pushing yourself up onto your knees, Making sure your knees are underneath your hips, hands are underneath your shoulders, and your back is nice and straight. From there, arching your back up to the ceiling, sucking in that belly button, going up as high as you can. And gently bringing it down, pushing out the chest, lifting the head, looking up as high as you can, keeping the belly nice and low. Good. Second one. Up. Up with the back. Sucking in the belly button. Going as high as you can. And bringing it down. Getting down as low as you can. We're going for a last one. Going up nice and high. Sucking in the belly button. And gently bringing it down, pushing out the chest. Very good. Placing your hands a little bit more forward, straightening out the back. And sitting back onto your heels, keeping your head nice and low. Stretching out the back. From there, we're going up onto our knees, just moving out the shoulders, move them around a bit, roll them out, making sure the blood gets flowing to all the joints. Okay, so we're going to use our feet as balance, placing your right hand on your right heel, leaning back with your left hand and pushing the hips forward. Feel the stretch in your quads. Nice deep breaths. Very good. Switching sides. Placing your left hand on your left heel. Right hand goes up in the air and pushing forward with the hips. Good, and relax. Okay, take a sip of water, relax the muscles a bit, and then we'll continue. Right, guys, so we're still on our knees. If you need to for the next one, please fold your mat in, in half so that you've got a bit more support underneath your knee. I want you to bring the right leg to the front. Body weight is on the left leg, and we're pushing forward with the hips. Getting a good stretch in that hip flexor. Back is nice and straight. Taking nice deep breaths. Good. And slowly back to the middle. Now I want you to extend the front leg. Heel into the floor. Using your hands either side of your leg as balance. And sitting back slightly. Feel the stretch in your hamstring. Down the back of your knee. Taking nice deep breaths. Everything nice and controlled. 
Good. Slowly up, placing the foot on the floor again and pushing forward with the hips. Feel the stretch in your hip flexor. Good. And slowly back to the middle. Now we're switching the legs around. Placing the left leg to the front. All the weight is on the right leg. Left foot forward. Pushing forward with the hips. Feel that stretch. Keep your back straight. Keep on breathing. Good. And slowly up. Extending your front leg. Heel into the floor, hands down and sit back slightly. Once again, feel the stretch down the back of your leg. Okay, from there, slowly up, placing your foot on the floor again and pushing forward with the hips. Remember to breathe. And back to the middle. From there, we're going slowly onto our feet. Just shaking out the legs, shaking out the arms, rolling out the shoulders, getting movement in everything. All right, so starting to get to the end of our class, placing our feet nice and wide, toes forward, hands going down to the floor again. Keeping your legs straight, keeping your back straight. Now, walking with your hands as far forward as you can go. What you feel comfortable with. Remember to keep your back nice and straight. Walking the hands back, in between your feet, as far back as you can go. Good, and back to the middle. Slowly up with the shoulder roll. Right, bringing the feet closer together, hips facing forward. Placing your left hand on your right hip, right hand behind your back, looking over the shoulder. Very good, facing forward, switching around, right hand on your left hip, left hand behind your back, looking over the left shoulder. And facing forward, good, bringing your hands to the front, fingers up, gently pull back on the fingers. Very good. Fingers down. All right. We're moving over to the other side. Fingers up. Gently pull back. And fingers down. Good. Shaking out the arms. Right, bringing your arm across your chest again, stretching out the shoulder. Pushing it back, pushing out the chest, feel the stretch in your chest. And the other side. Okay, pushing it back. Rolling out the wrists. Nice big circles. Change direction. Moving over to the arms. Slowly rotating them to the back. As big as you can. And to the front. Remember to keep the belly tight. Keep on breathing. All right, and shake out the arms. Okay, keeping your shoulders horizontal. 
dropping the head over. And slowly up, over to the other side. Very good, and up to the front. And back. Back to the middle. Feet coming together. Straight back, only bending at the hips, going down to your toes. Muscles are nice and loose now. Everything has been stretched, so touching the toes would be much easier. From there, nice deep breath. Inhale through the nose. And exhale through the mouth. Second one, in through the nose, and out. Last one, nice deep breath, in. And all the way out. Slowly coming up, straightening out the back, straightening out the shoulders. Very well done, guys. Thank you very much for joining and see you soon.